Hi, I'm Lindsay Nauman from Synergy Group based here in Detroit, Michigan. So rapid prototyping parts usually can only take engineers so far in their development. Usually you send a CAD model to a company, they produce a one-off part for you before you manufacture, before you go into hard tooling. But really those prototype parts can only take you so far in the developmental process. They usually break, they warp, I mean they can even get destroyed under hot tea water. With our parts though, why we're here is to educate the engineers so they can better prove out their designs during development and get a prototype part that actually works and function comparatively to the actual production part that they would have. So before they go into hard tooling, before they kick off on expensive, huge tooling, they get a prototype part from us. And again, they're able to actually test it out just as if it was in production. The material that we're using is a glass-filled nylon. It's very comparable and it mimics a glass-filled 30% uh, nylon 6 material. Um, so it, it reacts and it performs just the same as a production material would. So typical rapid prototyping process is there's a ton out there. Usually you've got your little glue gun on a gantry that squirts out gel with some, some lights that cure it. With our process though, we use a modified laser sintering technology. And what it does is it takes glass filled nylon powder based material and it sinters cross sections with a laser. So what you have is parts that are more robustly produced and we've actually also modified the machines so that they make parts more accurately than any other laser sintering machine that's out there on the planet today. We also have some pretty big parts too. So full size SUV bumper fascias like that one right there, that can be done in several sections and right on a vehicle for wind tunnel testing. These parts are strong and again the, the machines that we're using are huge. So one of the things we specialize in for rapid prototyping parts is our engine parts. Basically anything that's under a hood that's black, that's plastic part, we make for functional testing. The manifolds that we produce, we're kind of the only guys to do it in the industry on a functioning level. We've got a post process that seals up the parts that makes them impervious to fuels, oils, coolants, urea, basically all the nasty stuff that you'd see on an engine during testing, our parts are impervious to. They're also airtight. We can see up to 140 PSI, 9 to 11 bar of static burst pressure, and that's based on manifold testing. These are serious parts. These are real deal, rapid prototype parts that you can actually use on a dyno. A lot of our customers try to go out and they purchase what looks like to be a rapid prototype part, a functional rapid prototype part. But without that sealant, without that internal infiltration process that we provide exclusively by Synergyring Group, there's really no way to seal in all that residual powder that's left on the parts when you produce these with the laser sintering process. And it's crucial for engine testing. Can you imagine all that little glass filled nylon dust getting into your engine? It's going to completely ruin your dyno test. It's expensive, it's time consuming, and you don't have that kind of time or money, I'm sure, to waste on a prototype part that's just going to ruin a dyno test. 